G'day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the YouTube channel. My name is Cody and today I'm here to give you my grand final tip and preview of 2024. Yes, we have finally made it to the big dance. It is the first place Melbourne Storm against the second place back to back to back defending premiers, the Penrith Panthers. Now before I get into the tipping preview, I'm just going to clarify something guys. I do apologise for missing last week's preliminary finals tip video unfortunately i've been very very unwell for the last few days and for pretty much last week as well so and i've been a bit busy with in my personal life as well so i do apologize for not making the video last week but i'm back at it with this one and yeah so hopefully this should should be an entertaining game we have seen this game previously back in 2020 funny enough this is going to be the first time we have had a repeated grand final since 2000, 2007 and 2008 when it was Manly versus Storm. And they both won the game. But obviously Mel 2007 for Melbourne Strip along with 2009. This will be Melbourne's first grand final as well since 2020. Which, funny enough, this this was, they were the last team to beat the Panthers in the grand final back in 2020. Where they won 26-20. And since then, Pembroke have gone on to beat the Rabbitohs, the Eels, and the Broncos in the last three grand finals. Both in the regular season between both of them, Melbourne have won both of the regular season games. Melbourne won 8 0 in the first round, and then in mid August, Melbourne also won in a close game 24 22. So Melbourne have beaten the Panthers twice in the regular season. And in regarding to finals, these two have already played in three finals games. Obviously, including the um, grand final for 2020, where Melbourne won 26-20. Next one was in 2021. Penrith won that one, 10 points to 6. And then their most recent finals game, which was last year, Penrith flogged the Storm, 38-4, in the preliminary final, or the semi, yeah, the preliminary final last year, which... That which punch, punched their ticket to make their third consecutive grand final. Alright, now let's get to the team changes for the side. We'll start off with Pembroke first. So Scott Sorensen's listed among the reserves to return from a hamstring injury. Should he be a late call-up? Most likely Matt Heisen if will replace him on the bench. And Brad Snyder will retain his spot to cover Nathan Clary as last week... Nathan Cleary exit the field with about like seven minutes to go because he he re, might have re-injured his shoulder and he's definitely going to go for shoulder reconstruction surgery after the grand final. And as for Melbourne, the big one, Nelson Asona Solomona has been suspended for this game for, for a ridiculous tackle last week. Correct call, by the way. He, he was challenged. Unsuccessful and now he's suspended for five games. So here it goes for Melbourne. So Tui Kevin Kamifa gets the call up into the starting side and Lazarus Valapia Piu, sorry for butchering the name, has been added to the bench. Kevin Kamifa has started for 14 of his 21 appearances this season. The 30 year old has played 113 games for the Storm and will be in his first grand final, while 25 year old Valapia is just seven games into in his career, so very impressive having debuted in round 20 against the Roosters. So Sua Falongo and forwards Tepi Morata and Joe Chant are among the reserves after featuring in the Bears North in the, in the Bears Grand Final last, last week while Grant Anson is 18th man. So quite a few changes there for Melbourne, but Sucks for Nelson. It was his own doing. He should not have done that ridiculous high tackle last week, but it was gonna be it was gonna be unsuccessful regardless, so sucked in the win. But here's the big one. Who is going to be the 2024 my the 2024 premiers? Is it going to be Melbourne? Who are looking to claim their fifth premiership, their first one since 2020, or will it be the Panthers? Making it to win four in a row, a, t a feat a feat that has not been done since the Sir George Dragons of the 1950s and 60s, where they won 11 in a row between 1956 and 1966. My tip 
for this game and your 2024 premieres, in my opinion. I think Melbourne's going to win it. Melbourne have beaten them already twice this season. And their wins against the Sharks and Roosters in the finals have, were um, quite a smash out, even though the Roosters did catch up before Storm closed it out. But I think Storm will win it and will end the reign of the Panthers, who have won the last three grand finals. And Clive Churchill medalist? Well, should the Storm win? I reckon Clive felt the Clive Churchill medalist for the Storm is going to be Jerome Hughes. He's just been the best player, no doubt, this year, and the best halfback. And as for Pemriff, if they win and the Clive Churchill goes to them, I reckon Isaiah Yo will get it for the Panthers. But there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That will wrap up my video of the grand final preview and tip of 2024. I hope you guys enjoyed this preview. I know it's a bit of a shorter video than not usual, but unfortunately I'm not able to do it this way because of just how unwell I am at the moment. But in the next week or two, I will be back to posting videos like doing, like doing off-season content and stuff, but you guys will look forward to it. But anyways, guys, thank you all for watching the video and thank you for an amazing 2024. I appreciate every single one of you who have subscribed to the channel and po posting comments in every video. Thank you all so much. I appreciate all of you guys and I appreciate your positive feedback. 2025 is going to be a bigger and better year, but I'll be back to normal content in the next week or two while I'm just taking a break uh, from doing YouTube. Anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. Thank you for an amazing 2024. I'll see you all in the next one. And bring on the 2024 NRL Grand Final. Good luck to the Storm and Panthers. Wait and see who wins.